I'm so excited to see her little face. So I'm not spending £30 on something that's not going to last. She will love doing that. Good afternoon everyone and welcome back to Random Tuesday. Merry Christmas! It's nearly Christmas so I thought today I'd film a what I'm getting my toddler for Christmas. We bought her some small little gifts. She's mostly into crafts bits now. She's turning three in June. So she likes a lot of arty crafts and stuff like that. So this is what we got her this Christmas. We've got some toys as well. But we haven't put that much because she gets so many presents from other people. We've got a huge family on um, both sides that buy for her. So she hasn't got many from us and I'm yet to buy her main one. But I'm not actually quite sure what that's going to be yet. Because... She she really doesn't understand Christmas, she doesn't know what she should like, so I'm yet to choose something that she will love. So without further ado, let's get on with the first present. I bought her this. This is a uh, Disney Princess Paint Your Own Characters. She loves Disney Princess and she loves princesses. She loves anything like that and she loves painting. So this is what I got her. This is her first present I bought. It comes with the paint brushes and the paint and the three figures. 12 paints and one paintbrush. So we'll have a lot of fun doing that. We'll probably do that on Christmas Day. I'm so excited to see her little face. The next present I got, she she was into Peppa Pig a lot. So I did buy her um, some Peppa Pig puzzles. This is, upside so down, four puzzles I bought for her. So she loves Peppa. She did watch it a lot. She didn't watch it as much now. So I'm hoping she'll still like it. But I thought this is really cute. And this is can do when she's a like, little tired. She just wants to sit still and not concentrate too much because it'll be probably quite easy for her to do so uh, that's the next one the next one i've got is just like a little stocking filler really it's this baby bear grass grass head type thing um i know you put um i think you water it you put it in water the instructions have rubbed off because they've been in storage but this is really kind of cute and I'd love to see her like how like grass grows. You have to water it and she can also learn with this. This is quite fun, a fun toy as well. It's just a little teddy bear in there and I think it grows a lot too. Or it might not grow, it might just grow loads of grass. So I thought that'd be interesting to see because she can watch it grow. The next one I bought for her was this little fishing, fishing, wind up fishing game. I bought this from Wilco yesterday actually. We went into Cambridge town. And I thought this was kind of interesting. It'd be like really cool to play with the family on Christmas Day because you can have up to three players. So I thought that would be really, really fun. And it'd be a, quite a quite a laugh trying to catch all the fishies. So she'd love that. The next thing I bought her, um, if you watch our videos, you'd know my daughter loves makeup. She's really into makeup, nail varnish, anything girly. She just loves so um, we went to Primark the other day and I bought this little sparkle and wish set. This I think was £5 this was. It comes with some eyeshadows, a nail file and lipstick and free nail polish with the um, eyeshadows applicators. She will absolutely love this. I really wanted to buy her like a big makeup vanity case. They're a little bit expensive for what they are, I think. I think I've seen one for £30. And no offence to, obviously, her, but she will ruin it. She doesn't, like, put makeup on when they're supposed to go. She's not at that age where she understands yet. She just sees the colours and wants to play with them. So I'm not spending £30 on something that's not going to last. I forgot to go through the prices with you, didn't I? So I'll go through the prices with you now. I think this one was £2.50. So it was really good, cheap little present that we'll all enjoy. This one was £2.52. I'm not 100% sure where I got it from, but if I can find it, I'll leave links down in the description. This Peppa Pig one, I um, actually got really cheap somewhere. Um, I think it was, we go to a lot of care, baby sales, like nearly new sales. This is obviously new. Um, I think this one cost me £1, so that was a bargain. And not being funny, she doesn't know that I got it somewhere cheap. It's just the same to her. This one, I actually bought at a baby sale an nct baby sale which is really cheap this is what i do i pick up presents along the way out through the year so i can pick them up cheap and we don't have to worry till christmas time you know we've got because there's a lot of expense at christmas let's be honest so i picked up this for five pounds and i thought that was really really good 
so she will love playing with that and the next thing i got is something cheap again she loves her bath she loves playing with the toys so i thought why not get her some bath crayons and then she can make a mess in the bath because toddlers you know they love making a mess so this is what i bought it's a pack of six colors and they're only really little things like maybe stocking fillers you can do but i think this was like two pounds so again really really cheap the next thing i bought i do not advise to buy but she loves it so i have to buy it but i think it will be going around nanny or grandma and grandpa's house because this is the very messy magic sand this is from primark she loves it but i wouldn't have it in mine again because it makes too much of a mess and i do not like mess it gets absolutely everywhere it's gone underneath my skirting boards it went everywhere but it's she loves it it's a lot of fun obviously toddlers love that creative messy play so that's really good and this was three pound from primark so brilliant and it comes also with the um pyramids and little boxes in there and like everything so that's really cool i actually took them out i'm not sure why i took them out but i took them out it's very play though it was next thing i got her quite boring once again but she is getting a lot of presents from other families so it doesn't really matter but this crayon set it is super tips and they're washable markers and i thought oh this is really good value for money i think it was four pound we always go through felt tips and then when i went to see if we had any felt tips the other day we didn't because i think i took clean mostly away because she kept drawing on the on the walls when she was a bit younger so i thrown them away and we always lose them as well. So I thought with this one we can put them in a separate pencil case so we don't lose them. And this was from Wilco's. Next thing I bought was this. Also she loves like doing her nails and that. She's really actually quite good at doing her nails. She just gets it on her nails. But she loves all this girly stuff and it says it's this. 12 nail polish set from primark these are really glittery nail polishes i thought that was really cheap they are quite small and there's so many different colors in there i think she's got loads of different colors to use with so i thought she'd love to play with these and two pound fifty that's a bargain in my eyes yeah she'll love that and i thought it was really cute from primark if i didn't say that okay and the next thing is this little towel monkey towel my um auntie actually bought her this for her last year's present i think she got one and um this she got my auntie bought it for her last year and then she loved it so much i had to buy her another one so i bought her another one um it's the animal mad cheeky monkey hooded bath towel I thought she does love monkeys now. She used to hate monkeys, but she loves it now. So, it's another thing we got. I don't know where that's from. I think it's, I bought it from, um, I'm not sure. <laughs> Amazon. Amazon. Maybe this is a bit young for her. I don't know. But she loves doing little wooden puzzles and things. So, I picked this up. I think this was from Poundland, actually. Picked it up really cheap. And, obviously, it was really good. Just little crabs. And she can send the animals to me as well. She might be a bit young for this, so I might give this to her baby brother instead. But he's only a month, so it'll probably be too old for him. But yeah, I thought that was really interesting and cute. Next thing I got is this chalkboard. Obviously, she loves messy play, so I thought she could do her own pictures and learn about chalk. Because I know that's different for her, because she's mostly used crayons and pens and stuff. So I thought, this is really good. It comes with a rubber thing to wash off, and I thought that's a pound from Poundland so you can't go wrong with that just cheap presents this year the next thing I bought her was this Cinderella doll she loves Cinderella stuff so we bought her a little Cinderella doll so she can play with that she loves her babies as well so this will be like another baby for her also I picked this up at an NCT baby sale which was £2.50 bargain put that right in my basket next one is a my little pony set and this is brand new so it's lots of different felt tips again coloring chunky pens paint paintbrush sharpener eraser pencil and art pad 12 watercolor paints so i thought that's really good so we could do some more paints because i know the felt tips were that really easy as well they don't last very long i thought why not stock up and it's obviously my little pony colorful so she'll love it um baby sale two pound this one is really good um it's make a princess mirror so that's kind of cute i didn't know i picked this up so oh wow 
So you actually have to mould it and yes it's really starting from scratch and you paint it and then you sprinkle glitter on it and then attach the mirror. So that's really cool. I like this idea because she loves doing stuff like that. She's very into making stuff from from scratch. Like she loves baking and that. So I'm sure she'll love this just as much. And then she'll actually keep it for keepsake as well. Obviously I picked this up from a baby sale as well. I used to stick on it and that was £2. Next, this one's not exactly for Christmas. Uh, for a present for her. But I thought this was really good. I picked it up yesterday in Poundland. But I thought this is a really fun thing to do when Christmas Eve before Santa gets here. So it just makes them a little bit extra fun for them putting the things on the plate. Special drink, carrot and mince pie. And I love the idea of that because she, it's very colourful and it makes everything more exciting. Um, Andrew brought me the, her this. Um, she loves goo and slime and stuff and all things messy like that. She watches YouTube videos with slime, I think. Thanks, YouTube. Um... So I just got her the glue and it's like a pink gooey slime thing. So she'll like playing with that. I didn't get a green one I think. I'm not sure where that's gone. So the next thing I got her, which I we opened this because we actually thought we could do presents with this as well. So make presents out of a present. So I gave this present earlier. So th this is one of your Christmas presents. We could do it earlier. It's actually a jewellery making set. I hope no one's watching this in my family. But I thought we could make them as presents to like make a bracelet as a present. So I thought that's really good. She loved doing it and she loves designing things like that. So I really recommend this. This was actually 4 99 from eBay. Because I did look at the ones on like Amazon, but they were very they were too expensive. So I bought her a 4 99 though and it came in like a day. So it was really, really good. And the next thing I bought her, um, it's kind of a learning thing as well. So it's um Water Magic. So this is free plus, but she's actually quite um, intelligent so we thought we'd give her this but it's water magic now these are really really good actually I've never seen them before um, it's a pen you fill up with water and then you draw on the paper it's like a card or something a card and it will come off with like all different colors so on the paper so it's really really good and also it fades within seconds as well so they can do it again at a later date I've never seen this before. I saw it in Morrison's and this woman came up to me. She was like, she saw me look at them and she was like, wow. She said they're really, really good. So I got two. I've drawn one, which I gave her one early because that's what I do with her Christmas presents. I buy them, give them early. Shouldn't do that, but I do. <laughs> so this is really good. That was £5 reduced to 2 50 So I thought that could be really helpful for her learning as well. And the next thing I got is a penguin money box. You paint your own money box. So we've got this. Um, penguin money box she paints it that's really 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 good um, I like this she did one before at school but her one broke so we have cats so she can do another one and she can put her coins in there that she gets for Christmas so that's really sweet charity shop one pound can't go wrong there next thing I got was also from a charity shop it is she loves doing like hairdressing and stuff so and nails as well so we bought her this Glimmer Girls, I don't know if you can see that, Glimmer Girls doll head thing. If she could do her hair, do her nails, create lots of hairstyles. She's very creative like that. She loves doing their baby's hair, but it's all matted. So we got this um, for her, which I love it. It's so good and easy for her to do. She can do what she wants with it, so that's quite cool. Um, that was actually the last, last present. That was from a charity shop, £5. So that was the last present, so that's all we have for her yeah it's only like 2nd december so we are planning on buying her her main present but i have no idea what yet and also they're really really cheap presents as well so if you're on a tight budget it's perfect because all these little things they do add up and like i said if you go around during the year it's, it's really easy to just grab something for two pounds or even go to the charity shops or baby sales and that because i know at christmas is the worst time of the year so but yes, I hope you have a lovely Christmas, guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more. We upload every day for daily vlogs and obviously we do a random Tuesday, which is pretty kind of random, every Tuesday, obviously. So thanks for watching, guys. Merry Christmas. Have a great one. Bye.